Welcome to my series on raising Coturnix quail. In this video, I'm going to show you a very interesting way of turning quail manure into protein that can be fed to other animals, such as tilapia, catfish, quail, chicken, or other animals. Waste products such as manure can be turned into protein with the help of black soldier flies. In a nutshell, how it works is the black soldier fly will come and lay eggs in one of these uh, bins right here. They're homemade versions of them as well. Then the eggs will hatch and then the eggs, the larvae, the babies will consume any waste product in this bin. Then it gets bigger and bigger and a bin like this will allow the uh, larvae to crawl up the ramp and be self-harvested. So I'm rinsing out my Biopod Plus that I've been using for about five years now. This has worked really well for my very small scale production. A small pod like this can process about five pounds of waste a day. I will finish up rinsing off this pod and then I will show you how to set one up. It's a very quick and easy process. What you'll need is a container such as this Biopod Plus and of course some fresh quail manure and some bedding. My Biopod Plus came with this piece of green filter material, which I put placed at the very bottom. And then there's this piece of hard plastic with holes punched in all over it. I place that next. Now I will add the bedding. The bedding is just some old leaves and twigs from my yard that's kind of composted a little bit. I added a bit of water in there, yeah, maybe a little bit too much. You don't want it to be too wet. The good part about this um, container is that it has a drainage hole at the bottom, so if there's any extra liquid, it can just be drained off. A little bit of quail manure goes in next. This is enough to attract the black soldier fly to come and lay eggs. Once the eggs hatch, you can add more because now the larvae will start to consume the manure. They can eat up to five pounds of waste a day in this size container. Once they're mature, they'll naturally crawl out of the food and try to find a place to hide. This is the catcher for the larvae once they fall down. The reason why this is a self-harvesting container is because when the mature larvae crawl up the side of the pod, which is angled just right, as it reaches the opening, it falls into the catcher. Brilliant, right? Now I will cover it up and wait. It usually takes about two to four weeks before I spot any eggs. It depends on how warm the temperature is outside. I'm only made aware of black soldier fly about five years ago. I'm really fascinated by them. They are much larger than house fly, but they're not pests because they don't need to eat. After they emerge as flies, their only purpose is to mate, lay eggs, and then die shortly after that. I became interested in them as a source of food for my tilapia in my aquaponic system. Now that I keep quail, I'm really happy that they are also very good at processing quail manure. Eventually, I would like to get one of these large containers. This can process up to 25 pounds of waste a day. I will place this unit under a shaded spot. I wish I can tell you that I have always been successful with this method. I have made some mistakes that I wish I didn't, 
such as adding too much waste in here, and it turned out to be a stinky mess. So the take home lesson is only add a little bit of waste a day, up to about five pounds. Also, don't let the stuff in it dry out. I hope you found the video helpful. Please let me know if you have some experience with black soldier fly larvae or other methods you're using to compost your quail or chicken manure. I'm having so much fun making videos on raising Coturnix quail. Thank you so much for watching and letting me share this hobby with you. Remember to check out my other videos if you're curious about raising Coturnix quail. They're so cute and so much fun to raise. They don't take much space, they give you eggs, and they help your garden become beautiful and lush and productive. Again, thank you so much for letting me share this experience with you. I hope to see you soon. Have a great day. Bye!